So I've seen a few of these videos online where people are cutting a knurl in their CNC lathe. So I just thought I'd have a bit of a go at it and see how it turned out. Oh, I'm not real confident that it's going to turn out real well, but we'll give it a go and let's see what it looks like. All right, we're ready to hit the cycle start. Let's see what it looks like. out of focus. Yeah, well, as you'd expect, it's quite quite ripped and torn. I'm going to give it a bit of a linish and then we'll have a look. I'll cut back to that. So, as you can see, it's um, it's okay. I wouldn't say it's great. Uh, it's It slightly resembles a knurl of somewhat. Look, if it was a non-critical part which just needed a bit of grip, so like a, like a knob of some sort that the customer was okay with that kind of finish on it, then fair enough. Is it a solution that I would adopt? Mm, not really. But anyway, it can be done, and that's sort of what it looks like. I'm sure, I'm sure it can be better than that, but that's what I've got at the moment. Here's the code that I used. This is on a Mazatrol. So there's thread out. I've got a 35 millimeter lead. 60 degree angle, there's 25 starts to the thread with 0.6 height of thread. Uh, I'm cutting each uh, pitch at five passes with a velocity of 15 meters a minute. And so he, here's, the, here's the code you really need to know. So we start at our diameter that we're going to cut at, which is 39 for this instance here, at a starting point Z of zero. So we'll cut into um, 20 mil and then on the next line you just put another line straight in and back that thread straight back out to zero and that'll do it alrighty guys that's it for me it's a plausible method but it's not something I would use I don't think in production